What's going on everybody? All right, I got something in today that I was pretty excited about getting. Um, ordered this actually while I was in Florida in St. Pete a few weeks back. And I meant to order this last year. I talked with the with the guy that, that does these and you know, he gave me a little bit of a discount because I am a YouTuber. I'm going to do a YouTube review on it. Um, but I forgot to order one last year. So for some odd reason, I think my cousin had asked me if I had ordered the uh, the grip. It is a, a steady grind design uh, grip module. As you can see, this is unloaded. Um, grip module for the P365. Um, love this, we'll do a comparison here in a minute. But I think he'd asked me if I ever got that in. I said, I, I forgot to order it. So I contacted him again like a year later and uh, I went ahead and placed my order. Now let's do a little bit of a comparison. Here is your standard P320 grip module. You can see there's nothing up here, nothing over here. Very, very fine stippling on the front and back right here. So if we go into the steady grind design grip module, you can see we now have stippling up here. You have stippling up here. The whole grip module is stippled all the way around. And then the same thing on the other side. This is called the lava stippling. Uh, he did suggest this because for concealed carry, you don't want something real, real rough. But I will tell you that just really, really locks in your hand. I really like the the memory grooves on the thumb up here. Now, one thing I did do, and I did this even before I ordered the grip mods or anything, I did um, stipple my TLR6 on the bottom and the sides, and I just really like that as well, along with the um, stippling he did and the stippling I did, it just really locks it in. In my opinion, if you take a 12 round magazine in this, you can get a full grip. Um, this is the perfect carry gun in my opinion now there are some more stuff i plan on doing this i do plan on sending off the slide having some mill work doing done on the front and having it milled out for a hollison uh, 507k uh, so uh that is what i have on my glock 43x and i do plan on putting one on this as well and i also plan on getting one of the streamlight tlr subs to go on this uh, whenever they become available. I think the SIG ones are still back ordered and it's gonna be harder to find a holster. Speaking of holsters, if you pair this up with a Tuxton Tactical Appendix Rig, uh, like the sidecar version, um, I think this is the best carry option there is. This stippling is, like I said, amazing. It really locks into your hand. I wish I could link them below. Um, how I found them was on Instagram, Steady Grind Designs. Um, on Instagram and just DM them or you could Google them as well. Uh, if I if I link them in the description, YouTube will probably just cancel the entire channel. But I really think this came out amazing. I'll add some pictures at the end so you can see some close-ups, but you can see how he went around the Sig uh, Sour that's actually in this right here. Uh, here's kind of a comparison shot. You can see the work they did was just truly amazing. Um, everything is a very uniformed, um, and it's just enough texture that this does not want to slip out of your hand. It feels very good. It feels like it locks in well. It feels like it locks in way better than the SIG one does. Um, when I just rub the two like this, this feels like it has more grip to it. But like I said, it's not, the lava at least, is not so rough that you have to worry about it rubbing your skin. I've had some stipple um, jobs or even some factory like HKs that have made me bleed from carrying them all day long. But this uh, is not the case. This is about perfect for an EDC. And like I said, they did incredible, incredible work. Again, uh, Steady Grind Designs, huge thank you to them. Go check them out. Uh, order a grip you can i think you can either send your grip to them if i'm not mistaken or just order one from them and they'll send you the entire grip uh i just got a new grip and and kept my old one uh, that was just easier for me that way i didn't have to send my carry gun in because this is the gun i carry every single day i didn't have to do without my carry gun until i got this in I'm very easy to change these out i will show you how to do that there again youtube rules says i cannot show how to disassemble a firearm but all you have to do is just knock this little pin out right here just pushes out you just pull up on the back 
and then just pull the whole internals out of this gun, stick them down into your new one, put the pin back in, throw your slide back on, and that's it. Uh, really, really easy to do. You should know how to field strip your pistol if you are if you have one, uh, but for those who don't, all you do is just lock the slide back, pull this lever down, pull the slide off, and then again, push that pin out, everything comes out after that. Very easy to do, awesome grip module, love it, feels amazing. Go check out Steady Grind Designs. Um, I would say in the description below, but you'll have to go to Instagram or Google them for that for many various reasons. But um, great job, love it. I appreciate them sending this out. I appreciate you all watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. We'll see you next time.